to my channel. Today I'm styling two more of my twin sets from my closet. We are going to valorize them as you could see. So yes guys, as you know on this channel Sustainability Matters we focus on natural fiber. My current mantra on this channel is fabric fit and style. So we do embrace imperfect sustainability because we are all imperfect human beings. So today I'm going to leave you some sustainability tips on how you could be imperfectly sustainable if you choose to do so. <laughs> so guys, let's get to this video. I was so excited to discover these two pieces and they are jumpsuits. Actually, they are play suits. It's my okay. bad, guys. I enjoyed styling these pieces so much. And of course, we are going to start off with the very piece that I am wearing. I'll be styling it with this cotton shirt. I could just remove the shirt. And this belt. And I also flip it around to give you the versatility of this belt. And this is what the shirt looks like. The shirt is a piece I got ages ago, almost 20 years now. Oh my God, yes, unbelievably. And it had slits on the sides, but yeah, I renovated it. <laughs> As you could see here, these were slits on the side. So I had my centrist, um just sew it up and I only left the split detail at the back. And I, I love that. I think it's gorgeous. This is a piece that you could wear as a dress. As a jacket and it's a great bathing suit cover up so I love that and yes my boots I'm pairing it with my outdoor boots and my Stuart Weizmann boots So today is one of those gorgeous fall days when you could act like it's still summer. So that's what I am sort of doing today except that I am wearing thigh high boots. <laughs> but yeah, on days like these, you could definitely show your clavicle, wear the play suit as a summer piece and just add the jacket when it gets a little bit cooler but i think that for the past few days it has been really really nice climate change is real guys so i could get away with valorizing it with very lightweight linen cotton blend pieces and this gorgeous belt that i can't get enough of so be inspired guys Yeah, 
absolutely looks great. Sorry to interrupt guys, but just a quick note. Hi guys! If you just so happen to just click on my video, you are new, please click the red subscribe button. So here they are guys, if you click on these buttons, you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when I post new videos. And most importantly guys, it's free. Thank you so much for subscribing. Love ya! Let's get back to the video. Now on to twin set number two. This is what it looks like. It's this gorgeous blend of cotton and linen. Guys, this piece had me at linen and it's a perfect combination. And I know that there are issues with conventional versus organic cotton. Yes, organic cotton is the way to go, but I am sure that traditional conventional cotton growing is still happening. Just pay attention to your fabrics, guys. And if you want to choose something that you are confident about, choose linen. Linen is, yeah, it's the best. And here is a list of other natural fibers that, mwah, guys, they are amazing as well. My personal preferences are linen, cotton, and silk. <laughs> yeah, I love, I love those. <laughs> it's beautiful. I, I love it. I love the style, the ruching details. I love the fabric. It definitely checked the boxes of fabric, fit, and style. As you know, it's our current mantra on here. I would be followerizing it with this linen trench coat. And this is a piece I got from Zara ages ago and I got this at rock bottom price guys and it's such a gorgeous piece this is gonna be in my wardrobe forever I took this with me to the Caribbean and I love it on those cooler nights I just love this piece so yeah that's how I'm styling it today for you but as you can see they are wrinkled and that's the nature of linen and cotton guys I know trust me I've been there <laughs> with these fabrics I love them to death but they are very high maintenance fabrics so the best bet is to have a steamer at hand it's something I have to invest in I still use an iron so yeah <laughs> but 
I really, really do love these pieces. Guys, the lesson here is often to look into your closet, see what you could find. And for these particular pieces, as I've said, there are advantages of owning twin sets and triplets and quadruplets in your closet. If you find a style that you really love and you know that when you step outside that you're going to look fabulous and you know that it could pair with multiple pieces in your closet, you are on to something. So keep going at it. Some of the pieces that I did buy, if they are not of the greatest fabric, to be honest, I don't really love them, but these pieces, yeah, I love them. So I hope you enjoyed the styling. I hope you are inspired. And remember to always love yourself, accept your perfect imperfections, because they are what make you unique and drop dead gorgeous. Love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.